welcome back to another Delivered Reviewed. Happy New Year to everybody. This year we have, to start the year off, the Steakhouse Stack. And I'm not sure 100% whether they've done similar to this in the past, but Steakhouse Stack Meal and the Cheesy Garlic Bites plus Caramel McFlurry. On to the review, and the Steakhouse stack, as you can see there, looked pretty nice. Um, again, as with all McDonald's, a little bit dry, but additional to those is the cheesy garlic bites, which I thought were pretty nice. They were just a little bit too crunchy, and could probably do with being a little bit bigger. Um, but as you can see there, kind of a bit of a zoom in, you can see the um, texture to the cheese is, is soft. It's a nice cheese, just flavored with garlic. Um, so they were pretty nice, like I say, could do with being a little bit bigger. The fries, pretty much standard, they were good this time, they weren't too soft, they weren't too crispy, and um, they were still hot, so the McDonald's that I've got this from is pretty close to me, so, and um, as before, they, they retain the heat, which is, which is good, obviously. Um, so no difference to the fries this year, nothing for a new year as it were. Uh, no new fries, McDonald's standard fries. As you can see there, Steakhouse stack, ah, it's back. So they did do this a little while ago. Um, I've just probably forgotten um, that they've done that. But as you can see there, the building of the burger was horrendous. Like whoever put it on there, obviously the cheese, it just slid straight off one side. The boxes don't necessarily keep the burgers straight as everybody knows, but yeah, a bit of a mess. As you can see there though, the burgers themselves, they, they did kind of like break apart a little bit, which obviously is, you know, uh, a steak kind of feature almost, well not feature, but it basically did sort of fall apart. It didn't hold itself together, so probably quite minimal fat. Um, but it was really nice. Like again, I'm not quite sure why the burgers are smaller than the buns. Um, I forget now who else does similar, and it, it's, it's kind of like, it's not annoying, but like, why have different sized burgers to buns? Like, it's a multi-billion pound bloody company. But either way, who am I to say? The burger was nice, lettuce, uh, the peppercorn sauce was really nice, and a kind of like cluster of fried onions, which, if again, if they just spread them out a little bit, I know it's fast food, I know it's not gourmet, um, but they sort of position themselves as gourmet with these type of burgers, from my point of view. So they could just make the building of the burger a little bit better, build a bear, build a burger, same thing, um, and they'd probably be a hell of a lot better. So just to finish off is the Caramel Dairy Milk McFlurry, and I'm pretty sure they've done this before as well, uh, and it's, it's nice. I mean, there was, again, probably could do with a little bit more chocolate, a little bit more caramel, uh, but it was pretty nice. And then to top it off, just because they're still doing them for free, um, over £15, I think, which I know is a lot of money for McDonald's, but free chicken nuggets. So overall, I thought it was a very nice kind of new year um, menu item but it's still McDonald's got that little bit of dryness to it so the most I'm going to say which you'll see in a second 8.5 happy new year to everybody I hope everybody's uh, had a good start to the year massive thanks for everybody subscribed and obviously the views and hopefully more to come soon